football is a universal language and that is one thing that brings a lot of people together. The earliest memory I can remember of being somewhat depressed is probably, I guess, as I went to high school. Him and five of his friends come from behind and started hitting me, punching me, kicking me. My life changed at that moment. It was 18, I finally picked up the carriage and was like, I wanted to run away. The homelessness was an experience. I went severely depressed. Tried taking the easier option by killing myself. Somehow, I got pulled back. My husband, Fraser, has early onset Alzheimer's, so he was only in his 50s when he was diagnosed. He has a speech dysphasia, which is not normal for Alzheimer's, but it means he can't talk and he hasn't been able to talk for a very long time now. That one smile that I get from Fraser for whatever activity we do is what gives me the strength to go on to face the next day. And I try not to think too far ahead into the future because I know the future isn't necessarily going to have that great an outcome for us. I arrived in UK November 2021. In Kurdistan, wasn't the good opportunity for us and the quality rights wasn't good enough. I don't know it's going to happen one day to left my family and living alone. We are making our supporter base, our local community, the centre where they can feel comfortable. So the first time I met Bilal was at Preston College trying to promote football within their community. We all know football is something that brings a lot of people together. Life wasn't like that good for me because I didn't know how to speak English, I didn't know no one. And after, when I went to college, went to p and &E, helped them, and they helped me a lot. When they took me to Salford, I was in a homeless shelter. Um, the people who was homeless get put in there and they work for the charity. They introduced me to Foundation IT. I volunteered as much as I could, loved every minute of it. And then one day I got a phone call saying, there's a job here. That moment changed my life. Coming to Shrewsbury Town Football Club gave us an activity that Fraser enjoyed doing and introduced us to new people, all with different issues in their life or different troubles. Each brings a level of understanding and support and friendship to everybody else within the group. We've been in a very different place and not such a good place as what we're in now. Playing football, like met friends, it helped me for the language. It helped me to meet new people, make us be stressless. 
and don't think about what happened in the past and we think about future. Christmas is like my second home. I really like it and I want to stay here. We would be lost without this. We really would. Through the people and the friends that we've made here, we do other things and we'll go to lunch separately on our own. We go on holiday at the end of a phone call if somebody's hit a rocky patch. There's lots of other people here and ready to help. Very special people, very special to me. Do you know what, I've done quite well. I am still alive, happy, got a girlfriend, got a dog, got a house. Football, it changed life.